Hey, yo, Kev, what's good, man? Hey, I was scrolling through your Facebook, and I noticed that you've done a lot of stuff, man. You've been skydiving, bungee jumping, and even zip lining. Man. Yeah, man, I've done, I've done quite a bit of stuff, man. You've done quite the number of risky things, bro. I know, right? It's crazy. You got to trust these people with your life. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy. But I think that's where the thrill comes from. You know what I'm saying? You just don't know what's going to happen. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, that's crazy. But do me a favor. As your friend, you know I care about your well-being. I strongly encourage you. Start going to church and give your life over to Christ, man. I'm telling you, it's the best exhilarating feeling you'll ever have. Like, you know, give my life to Christ. <laughs> yeah, right, man. I can't do that, bro. I, I, I don't know, man. That's very, very risky, man. I just can't. I can't trust that, man. I don't know, bro. You know what I'm saying? I just, I just can't do it. I can't do it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> You know, bro, that makes n no sense whatsoever, but can't say I didn't try. You know, I find it so amazing that we can actually put our faith and our trust in man before we are able to put our faith and our trust in God. I think many people are afraid of change and are afraid of surrendering their lives over to God because of the fear of the unknown. I also believe that many people are afraid that they will not get the acceptance that they're currently getting, that they won't get the help that they're currently getting by operating in uh, the life that God wants for them. But I wanna remind somebody again, remember, God's plans are not to harm you, but to prosper you. Not only does God have plans for you, but he wants to remind you that he will be there with you as you are going through the journey that he has for you. The Bible says in Isaiah 41 and 10, Fear thou not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am thy God. I will strengthen thee. I will help thee. Yea, I will uphold thee with thy right hand of my righteousness. God is not going to give you a purpose and then throw you out to the pack of wolves. God is going to be right there with you. He said, wherever your feet will trod, I will be there with you. He will be there to help you and to strengthen you. Do me a favor. Put your plans on pause for a minute and try God's. I mean, what do you have to lose?